What if I told you that you can now create ultra-realistic AI videos using the same tech Google DeepMind uses and do it completely free? That's right, VEO3 is finally public, and today I'll show you how to access it step-by-step, -step, how to use it for free, and the best tricks to maximize your free usage. Let's dive in. What is VO3? If you haven't heard yet, VO3 is Google DeepMind's text-to-video AI model, and it's officially in public preview on Google Cloud's Vertex AI platform. You type a prompt like, a cinematic drone shot of a jungle waterfall at golden hour, and VO generates stunning, realistic, cinematic videos, all with AI. We're talking about motion tracking, camera control, scene consistency, and film quality visuals, just from words. But here's what's even better. You can now try it for free. How to access VO3 free, step by step. To get started with VO3 today, step one, go to cloudskillsboost.google. Step two, log in with your Gmail or Google Workspace account. Step three, in the top bar, find Explore and open it. Step four, once inside Explore, you'll find a tour of Google Cloud. Click it. Step five, click on Start Lab. Step six, you get Account Login. Right-click on it and open it on Incognito window. Step seven, find Vertex A on the left menu and go to Media Studio and then go to VO3 and start generating video free. You are now ready to use VO3 in public preview. Is VO3? Yes, but with a few conditions. Calic, Google Cloud offers $300 free credits to all new users. You can use these credits for Vertex AI tools, including VO. Check, once credits run out, you'll need to pay per usage. So if you're new to Google Cloud, you basically get full access to VO3 without spending a dime. And yes, you can sign up with multiple Google accounts to get new credits. Trick, multiple accounts equals more free usage. Here's the real hack. One, create multiple Gmail accounts, use different browsers or incognito mode. Two, sign up for a new Google Cloud project with each. Three, Claim the $300 credit every time. Four, use different payment methods, e.g. virtual cards, Revolut, Wise, etc. As long as you're not violating Google's abuse policies, this is a smart way to extend your free access. Use this trick responsibly and enjoy tons of AI video content generation without touching your wallet. How to use VO3 effectively Here's how to generate a high-quality video. Type your prompt in detail. A slow-motion scene of a ballerina dancing on a rooftop at sunset with city lights in the background. Select video style, cinematic, animation, fantasy, etc. Choose video length, typically 2 to 10 seconds. Check. Hit generate. Check. One, two minutes, your video will appear, ready to download. Pro tip, use verbs and cinematic language like tracking shot, aerial view, slow pan, volumetric lighting, epic cinematic atmosphere. The more descriptive your prompt, the better VO performs. Best prompts for high quality results. Here are some example prompts that work well. A futuristic city at night, neon lights glowing, rain falling in slow motion, a wide-angle drone shot of a surfer riding a giant wave at sunrise, an astronaut floating above Mars with planet Earth visible in the distance, a close-up of a tiger walking through the jungle, cinematic lighting, the sudden lamb environment details, time of day, and motion verbs for maximum quality. Alternatives if you hit usage limit. If you run out of credits, you can check. Use Runway ML Gen 2, still offers free generation daily. 
Check, Pika Labs, limited but great for animations. Kyber, for music-based content. Check, use multiple accounts with new credits, as mentioned earlier. You can even combine tools, generate video and VO, and edit in Runway or CapCut. Final tips and conclusion. So there you have it. You now know how to use VO3 for free, access it step-by-step, step, and even extend your access using smart methods. This tool is revolutionizing how creators, marketers, and storytellers work, and the fact that it's public is a massive opportunity. Sign up for Google Cloud. Claim your $300 credits. Check. Experiment with cinematic prompts. Save your best outputs for your portfolio or YouTube channel. And if you found this helpful, hit like, subscribe, and drop your favorite prompt in the comments. I'll feature the best ones in my next AI video tutorial. Stay creative, and I'll see you in the next one.